Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing this Barbie inspired makeup look. I actually wasn't going to upload this tutorial on my YouTube channel. Originally I filmed this tutorial um, for my Instagram for a 15 second video and a lot of you actually really liked it and wanted full details of what exactly I did. Uh, so this video isn't going to be as informative in a way uh, visually just because it was meant for my 15 second video so when I film my Instagram videos I have to pick and choose what information is most useful and what I should put out there so I'm gonna talk you through a lot of the stuff that I did so you get a full understanding of what I did I've obviously already done my foundation and my eyebrows. I'll leave links down to previous videos. I've already done that in the description down below. And then using my Moolot Cosmetics Cream Contour Kit, I'm taking the lightest colors and putting it in the areas that I want highlighted. And then after that, I go in with a beauty blender just to blend it all out to make sure it looks super, super smooth, just because that's what a beauty blender is basically made for to give you that airbrush look. After that, I'm gonna be taking this warm toned uh, cream contour in the kit as well. Contouring my face and bronzing my face. Um, this is kind of like the base look. Uh, you're not going to be piling a lot of powders on top, but you will be some just to be setting in and making sure it looks super smooth. Um, so yeah, that's basically what I'm doing now. And then after I'm taking my MAC Prep and Prime Translucent Powder, and I'm setting all the areas that should be more highlighted. I also do go under my contour just to get that more of a sharp contour. Uh, and then again, just all the places that need to be set and highlighted. After that, I'm taking my Painted Earth Cosmetics Powder. It is a tinted powder, so it's more my skin tone. And I'm going in all the areas that I didn't highlight. You don't want to mesh up all the highlighted and non-highlighted areas with a tinted um, powder because it'll just look like one color afterwards. And then after that, I'm taking my Kat Von D Contour Kit, Shade and Light Contour Kit. And I'm taking the bronzer, the more warm tone bronzer and I'm going over those areas that I contoured. After that, I'm taking a cool tone bronzer in the Kat Von D Shade and Light Contour Kit, just contouring my nose a bit and then putting the lighter shades that come in the same contour kit down the center of my nose so it highlights. Barbie does have a super slim nose, but honestly, I just like to do this in my regular routine. And from this NARS blush kit, I don't believe they have it anymore, but I'm just mixing the two colors together. I'll put down what they're called in the description. And I'm also using the Mary Lou Luminizer and highlighting all the areas that I want highlighted. Now from Sephora, I think it's called the Luster Matte and it's the shade Pink Luster Matte, I believe. I'll definitely leave that down in the descriptions as well. Um, basically, it's like a liquid lipstick. Uh, not super, super long wearing, but it's still nice. It does stay on your lips, but you will have to reapply. Super nice color, though. Um, I'm basically applying that all over my lips. has a really nice applicator, uh, so it's easy to put on without fixing up the edges as well. And from YSL, I'm taking number one, and I'm putting that on top, and I think it gives just the perfect... Barbie look. I'm now just taking Swiss Chocolate from MAC, taking a large blending brush and I'm just buffing that into my crease, super blended out, not anything super crazy. And from Makeup Geek, I'm taking one of their foiled eyeshadows in, in the spotlight. Perfect eyeshadow, I love their foiled eyeshadows. Um, and then after that, I am taking Swiss Chocolate, the same color I used in my crease, and just putting it on my lower lash line. After that, I just put a white eyeliner in my lower lash line. And after that, I didn't film it on camera, but from Quora, these lashes are in rows. Really great lashes to open up your eyes and for this Barbie look. But yeah, this is the finished look. I hope you guys liked it. If you did, give it a thumbs up and definitely leave a comment down below what tutorial you may want to see next. And I'll see you guys in my next video.